Uh, let's make more of those. So basically, we we have sustainable food now. We just need a lot of water. Actually, no, we don't because we need um we need components to continue having food. Is there any way to get wood and components in a sustainable manner? Um, bed, armchair, guitar, radio, simple heater, reinforced door. Once we bought up holes and windows to the shelter, we can think of reinforcing the door and installing a simple alarm system. Okay. Alcohol distiller. Distills moonshine into pure, high-quality alcohol component for meds and bandages or a bartering item. Moonshine still... Herbal workshop. So there's nothing that says... There's nothing about a possible... Hold on, let me just... Do you have a saw blade? There's nothing about the possibility of unlimited wood consumables, although maybe I can just like get as much stuff. Out of this guy here as possible. What would we give him for this stuff? Sugar. Sugar is used to make moonshine. I'm not sure if this is a good deal to be honest. Anyway, we did it. Uh, we need more water too. I mean, he has water, but what do I want to give him in exchange for water? Pure alcohol. Your alcohol for 10 water? I don't even know if this is good. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Okay, how long does it take to make 4 vegetables? Does it take 4 days to make 4 vegetables? If it does, we're kind of screwed. It takes... 3 days to make 4 vegetables? Three days to make four vegetables. And then you can turn one vegetable back into fertilizer. Which means that this only su supports one person. One vegetable garden supports one person. Uh. Oh, that's a bit of a problem. Okay, come on, get the um, get more water. Uh, yeah, make that. Very hungry, slightly sick, recovering. Oh, 
didn't finish the water. Some materials, some weapons, some parts. A huge amount of weapons, apparently. Shelled school, central construction site, supermarket. Some materials, huge amounts of weapons, lots of parts. Didn't we need a, a saw? Hotel, caution advised. Lots of parts danger, possible trade, caution advice. St. Mary's Church. Materials, meds, parts, trade, caution advised. It's almost clear, that's almost clear. Shelled school. Um possible trade danger. Some materials, huge amounts of weapons, loss of parts. I don't know. I don't know. So you... You are gonna sleep in a bed. You're gonna scavenge. No, you're gonna sleep in a bed. You're gonna guard. Uh, where do I go though? Do I... Possible trade danger. A group of rebel militiamen. They might be willing to trade. Serves the military snipers as a perfect vantage point, making it a dangerous place to visit. Left by construction workers and rebels who were held up for some time before they were driven out. Well, let's be dangerous. You know what? Not even a gun. Just a crowbar. <laughs> Good luck, Slata. The developer promised the apartments would be finished no matter what. Yeah, about that. Very hungry, slightly sick. Man, people are getting sniped. Alright, two bits of wood, let's not take that. Pew pew. Let's go down, because the snipers will be on the roof to snipe people, right? So let's not go to the roof yet. Okay, that's just junk. Uh, it's pretty disappointing so far. What is that, and how do I get down there? Oh, I shouldn't run. Maybe stop running. I'm not sure how to get up there. Oh, interesting. Alright, can't get across there. There's a bridge there, I see it. Nothing. Literally nothing there. Oh, this is uh, not looking good so far, is it? Alright, let's see what's going on here. That's not it! Alright, we haven't found the loot yet. Neither is that. You don't know how to reach that place. Oh, you can't. Okay, you can't get over there, right? Let me just run. Let me be a crazy person and run around. It's a 
child's drawing of people in a boat. Big letter under it read Mika. Daddy takes us to Grandpa on a boat. Please come too so we can play. Oh well. That's not gonna happen anymore. That is just junk. I'm assuming the sniper's not gonna hear me because he's further up. Not sure how to get up there. Alright, we still can't get over there. We've already spent half the night here and we've gotten nowhere. Alright, so we need a shovel to get through there, which we don't have. We don't have a shovel. <laughs> My ear's dead. Enough, they can't find us. Okay, well the snipers are shooting the crap out of people. Where are they going though? They're going that way? Uh, that's not good. And then the snipers come over here to shoot at people. There, alright. There's only two snipers. Can't be that dangerous. Oh, can I take the... did they have gear? Not really. Mid ingredients parts. This is the least productive scavenge so far. Are they still there? Alright, they're still there. How do I. He says, "Meds and bears are good for trading." Uh oh, food! Oh, there you go. F yeah, yeah. There you go. There's the loot. Uh, don't need that stuff. Are you high? What are you... <laughs> Why did you go that way? Why'd you go that way? Alright, well, we're dead now. Why did she go there? I didn't click over there. I never clicked over there. Seriously. Alright, she's dead. <laughs> the slot is dead, guys. Uh, Pavo is bleeding. Looks like he won't be able to make it. Lethally wounded? Serious? Now, what are you doing? If they kill Slasher, would they kill us all? Probably, dude. Still no rats. Uh, I thought he would get better if we slept enough, but he didn't uh, get better, guys. <laughs> uh, Papa was gonna die. Lethally wounded. Can Bruno survive on his own? Can he just grow vegetables and survive on his own without ever going back out there? Lethally wounded, bandaged, recovering, slowly growing vegetables, hungry, depressed, very tired. You know what? You can sleep. You can sleep. What if I never leave the house again? <laughs> I still need materials for water. Do I have enough remaining materials? 
No, I need to scavenge. But if I go scavenge, the people are gonna steal my things. I can't believe what just happened there. Like, you can't really tell. Please, nah, we're not helping you, dude. There's no help. There's no helping. Like, I thought there was a hole. I mean, you can't really see the holes in the ground. I thought you could, like, jump down from there, where Slata was. So I clicked go down, but then she went all the way around to the soldiers, and before I could click back, she was there, and then she died. That is the, uh... The most ridiculous thing. Do we talk to him? Bruno is very tired. Oh, wait, there's meat. You know what? Grab the meat. I wish we could help Pavo. Yeah, well, there's a hospital out there somewhere. Alright, let's turn one bit of meat into two bits of meat. Fine, let's answer the door. The game is about 40 days long. <laughs> Not even halfway high. What do you mean, hello again? What do you have? Hello again, how are you doing? Thanks to your help, all the wounded recovered and went back to their homes. One of them still needs bandages though, and I'm run out, can you spare any? I don't, I don't have bandages. Are you sure you can't help me? I don't have any bandages, dude. Maybe trading is the best way to go. I get the impression that trading is the best way to go. Hungry, lethally wounded, depressed, very tired. Alright, let's end the day. You can sleep in the bed, you can guard, and we're not gonna go scavenging. If Pavo dies, I think we lose the game. Pavo has some ugly looking wounds. This seems very serious. Okay, he's severely wounded. He's not he's not lethally wounded anymore. He's very hungry and very tired. Alright. Uh let's make him more water. I mean, we almost have sustainable food, <laughs> so there is that. Uh, make water... And then cook. if I should keep playing until we... I mean, this is like a, a pretty bad playthrough. But I also don't want to just give up. Like, what if we make it? We might make it. <laughs> we died... Two of our characters died to game mechanics. To not understanding game mechanics. Alright, let's sleep. <laughs>